if someone said to you, have you ever thought about homeschooling? And you think, nope, not really interested. Then uh, you might actually want to jump back to my last video and just take a second to take in the beauty of homeschooling first. But if someone said to you, have you ever thought about homeschooling? And your answer is, I mean, yeah, that would be nice, but I don't think I can. That's totally understandable. I found that concern to be rooted in the thought that school has to be a certain way and that you have to fit that mold. But the truth is, with homeschool, you create the mold to fit you and your family's needs. Maybe you feel like, I just don't have the time. I work full time. But homeschooling doesn't have to be during traditional school day hours and school days. Learning can happen whenever it works for you. And usually just two to four hours a day is enough. Or maybe you're worried that I can't afford all those learning materials to teach with. But you don't need to purchase any curriculum books or learning tools because there's already free tools available at the library, museums, in nature, and probably at home too. Materials don't have to be factory made. You can be creative and improvise. It's natural to have concerns like, I don't want to risk messing up their academics. I want them to be able to go to college. But homeschoolers often do better because they're learning one-on-one -on -one with less distractions. And they still graduate and get a diploma. Or maybe you feel like, I'm just not qualified to teach my kids. If this is a concern that's holding you back, I made you an empowerment degree and resume that you can download, print, and display as a visual testament to what you can do. It's linked in the description below. For now, if you're feeling like I'm not qualified to educate my kids, let me encourage you. You're the manager of a home, the supervisor of a team, you're an event planner, a counselor, a nurse, a chef, and yes, you are also a teacher. It's these types of transferable skills that enable you to homeschool. And with that in mind, I hope you feel more empowered. Like, yeah, I did teach them right from wrong and how to tie their shoes and answered thousands of why questions. That is teaching. Yep, it sure is. When I explain to them the differences between the 4th of July and Juneteenth, yep, that's a mini history lesson. When I explain to them why the leaves change colors, that was a mini science lesson. Uh-huh. And when I've planned our vacations and grocery shopping lists, yeah, you can apply those same planning skills to plan your homeschool schedule and lessons. The times I showed them how the kitchen appliances work. Absolutely, that's teaching experience. And when I made them flashcards to help them with their math, Yep, you can use that same resourcefulness to make and gather learning tools. I really do have the freedom, authority, and transferable skills to homeschool my kids. Yep, you already have what it takes. And then you might be like, all right, yeah, I can do this. I've got this. If you want to get an idea of what homeschooling is like, you can watch our homeschool day in the life video. And if you think, I know I can do this, but how do we start homeschooling? What do we need to do? A great place to start is with my How to Start Homeschooling class, or you can download the How to Start Homeschooling workbook to plan on your own. Both are linked in the description below. All right, thank you so much for watching. I hope you feel that this was really helpful. Be sure to download your empowerment diploma and resume, like, subscribe, and comment, and I'll see you in the next video.